It's time for this week's taste test. Yay! Mabel's not excited about this one because it's another one she can't eat, but she's got some leftover Thanksgiving turkey she's trying to eat. Today we are trying different flavors for coffee because although we don't really drink coffee every day, uh, a lot of my clients do drink coffee and they're always asking and looking for recommendations on low calorie, flavorful creamers. So we're trying some syrups and creamers today. You tried a new coffee flavor yesterday. You want to tell everybody about it? <laughs> it's not it, a low calorie one, by the way. It will not fit into this at all, but uh, we had to go to Caribou yesterday because Scooters was closed and they had something called a Fala Latte. It was eggnog uh, in, the, in the latte. Outstanding. Highly recommended. If you like eggnog at all, Caribou Fala Latte. Phenomenal. Do you know how many calories were in it? Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> I can't remember the number. Uh, These will not taste as good as that. I'm sure of it. But I will also say I did have scooters today and I had a sugar cookie latte there. And that was pretty good. Not as good as the eggnog, but that was pretty good. So if you're looking to have lower calorie options, you can always ask for uh, non-fat, low-fat milk, or almond milk is usually fewer calories, and then half the amount of flavors. So for today, we've got some of these nut pods which are pretty popular. They're in the healthy food section at our local grocery store. These are only, I'll let you take a drink while I try. What flavor is this? Um, this is uh, peppermint mocha, but these are all almond and coconut creamers. So it's gonna be a little bit different than your milk-based creamer. But the nice thing about these is they're only 10 calories per tablespoon. I did put two tablespoons in with the coffee. Um, do, you, do you taste the peppermint mocha at no, all? No, not really. There's really? a little bit at the end. Um, like an aftertaste to it, but usually peppermint really hits oh, home. Oh, I hit it. I, I got it a little bit. Uh -uh. It's usually, not heavy. No, but... usually peppermint to me usually hits home pretty hmm. hard right away, and I, I didn't taste it really. It, it's just barely a little bit on my lips. That's what I'm saying. It's like an and that's aftertaste. two tablespoons, and where you don't even have a full cup. So I'm wondering, should we let's put a little bit more in there and see what happens? Oh, <laughs> that's gonna be more calories, mm. but. Someone just got a little aggressive with well, me. Well, I know, but yeah, I hate the fact that you couldn't taste it. No. I might have to do that with all of them. There you go. So you might have to do that with all yeah, of them. Yeah, you definitely get the peppermint. So definitely going to need at least two tablespoons, maybe three or four, which brings it up to about 40, 30 or 40. No, but still, still nothing special. No, not at okay. all. I mean, I get it. I'm tasting a little bit, but I mean, I'm sorry if I'm... It's not full. Right. If I want peppermint flavor, I want peppermint flavoring. Okay. Otherwise, I could just get a plain creamer. It's just a, yeah, it's just a little hint. It's better than black coffee, but not no. super flavorful. No, yeah. All right, this next one is Put the... a little more in there just so we know, because you did the two. One. Okay. Just to be um, safe. We understand. I'm just trying to get adding more calories. Out. Sure, just for the flavor. Just for the flavor we're trying to All right, to get. we're adding more. This is going to be like all creamer. But just to see what happens. Uh, holiday eggnog. Again, this is the nut pod almond, almond, almond and coconut. Easy for Try you to say. Try that three times. Uh, do, do, do. Let's see. Zero added sugar, zero carbs, one gram of fat. Does it taste anything like holiday nog? No, it smells good. Like smell it before you do it. It Ooh, smells it does smell really good. good, but no, bland, very bland again. Ooh, I actually get a weird flavor that I don't like at all. It just bland to me. No, no, I did not like that one at all. No. At least this one, I could feel the taste the peppermint a little bit. No, nut pods so far, it's not doing anything for me. Okay, this one, I'm not really sure. I'm not a barista. Do you have any idea? Like, I have no idea how many pumps of syrup you're supposed to. Oh, because I am a barista. <laughs> you get coffee. Uh, here, try this. I have no idea what this is going to taste mm -hmm. like. So these I found at Bed Bath and Beyond. Uh, it's called Jordan's Skinny Syrup. It's Salted Caramel Twist. And I bought a three pack of these oh. and so much better. Okay, they have zero calories, which is amazing. Now it doesn't mean if you put the whole thing in, it's zero calories, but at least zero calories per serving. Yeah, you know you want more coffee in this one, but it's it, it, okay. there is actually salted caramel swirl taste in this. Very, very. Oh, good. much better. Yeah. Yeah. That would be that wonderful. That at least has it. a flavor. That would be wonderful in coffee. Yep. Okay, so we haven't tried the other two flavors, but so far the salted caramel swirl. Yeah, really good. That's like a good that one. one. Yeah. The skinny syrup too. I've never really done syrups before, so. Well, they put them in your in your fala latte whoa, cookie. Whoa. Yeah, you, they put the pumps of syrup in the fancy drinks you get. They do. Yes. Oh, they there do. You go. <laughs> they do. I don't watch.
how to make it? Yeah, it's like, uh, I, I would, that's why I asked for reduced okay. focus. Okay, okay. Um, okay. So I'm pretty sure I know what you're going to think about. Wow. Think about this one. We're just going to go ahead and add some. Another nut pod. This what, one's pumpkin what? spice, which I know you love because you got it every time we went for coffee between Halloween and Thanksgiving. So I know you like pumpkin spice, but... Again, great smell to it. Absolutely no taste. Gosh, that's too bad. But does it taste any different than black coffee does? Sure. But, but just but, no but added. It'd be like just adding cream, too. Well, I think that's the point. It's better than black coffee, but it's still low calorie. But no. Not if I'm, not if I'm expecting to taste pumpkin spice or peppermint. I smell it. Or, yeah, right. The smell is oh, great. Oh yeah, I smell it. Smells great, but again, nothing to it. Hmm. Nothing to it at all. Oh, yeah, sorry. it's better than black coffee because it's creamier um, and it doesn't have that like ugh, coffee. I will not be coffee. a Nut Pods uh, drinker though. Um, interesting. Sorry. Because this is like a, a good, healthier option that, like I said, is in the healthy option. I just okay. had a taste to it. Well, let's compare it to this because I think this is the brand everybody probably gets. This is not a low, necessarily low calorie, like the 10, right. 10 calories per serving. This is just the Nestle regular pumpkin spice oh. coffee mate. Smelled wonderful, <laughs> tastes wonderful. 35 calories per serving. I put two in there, so 70 calories. Worth it. Uh, total would be 10 grams of carbs, 10 grams of sugar. Worth it. Smells better, tastes way better. Oh yeah, that tastes way better. Hundred times better. Much, much better. Yeah. We had this in the house. I'd be drinking coffee in the house too. Big well, fan. Well, guess of what? Spice. It's gonna be in the house. Uh, but I moved on. Thanksgiving's <laughs> over. I'm now on wow. peppermint. <laughs> I moved on. I go through my flavors during the year. All right. Well, I think I know your rankings. You want to rank them? Yeah. I mean, I, I'd probably still put this first, but the syrup easily a close second, um, and then the other three are just not even worth buying. Sorry. Okay, I think that's fair. Um, I think the takeaway is, you know, we always get asked questions. Is it good? Is it bad? Can I eat this? Can I not? Yes, if you love creamer and you have to have it in your coffee, you can absolutely do it. Just be, just account for the calories that you're putting in your black coffee. That's the reason black coffee is great. It's zero calories, just like water. Um, but if you're adding in creamer, measure it out. Put it in and count the calories. Don't do what I just did and dump it in because then you really have no idea. But I also think these two right here, there's such good flavoring to mm -hmm. them. You could probably get away with not putting as much as you would think you need to put in to get that pumpkin spice mm -hmm. flavor or to get that caramel flavor. Like you don't need to put the two or three teaspoons in because I think it's, it's already going to be there. Is it caramel or caramel? We still we haven't all, settled We that all know it's caramel. <laughs> all right. Let us know what your favorite creamer is, uh, and maybe we'll give that a try next time. Yay! <laughs> See you next time.